This is a preview of Division the Throne Room. This prototype comes in a lovely little bag with good quality cards, some rules, some one player rules, and uh, some more cards that show you how the chess piece is moved if you need that. Uh, what you're trying to do is achieve these formations and when you achieve four of those, you win the game. You will roll the dice, choose one piece to make a move and take that move and then it's the next player's game, go. So here I've rolled the rook and the uh, king. I uh, need to get a rook to there and I need a bishop there and a knight there. I've already got the knight, the bishop, I've got a bishop there and I've got a bishop there. So I'm gonna move this bishop to here, taking the rook, the rook goes where the bishop was, and then it's the next player's go. You are allowed to move freely within the constraints of the characters, but you're not allowed to immediately reverse a move that your opponent has just done. So this player here wants to get the bishop to the middle, a rook to here, which is why that one's moved down there, and a knight to there. That's gonna be the most difficult because the knights um, move a certain way, but if they use the king to take the knight, that would obviously work. So they roll, they get a rook and a uh, pawn. Let's see what they might do. Uh, not a great option here, so we need to get them up there. So let's take that up there moving the rook down there and so on. And the next player would roll, they've got the bishop and the king. Uh, they don't have a rook there yet, so they would get the bishop into the middle. Now, no they wouldn't because they don't need the bishop in the middle, that's that one. So they want to set up a rook to go here. Uh, the king can't do that, so they probably just try and wreck some of this guy's plans. Uh, so let's put that knight to that rook two moves away, and then I've got two options. Next players go, they get two horses. Uh, I need to get one there, so if I go there, that will do that and ruin their plan, and so on and so forth. When you match a pattern, you put that card out, the first person to complete four cards wins. In the solo rules, it uh, works almost exactly the same, except you roll two dice and they tell you which two cards you can move, and you get six total dice to try and match to the pattern. If you correctly do it, you put it in one pile. If you don't do it, you put it in another pile. And you're trying to get as many cards as you can. That's how to play The Division. Division then is a really nice two-player game with a cool solo player challenge. I really like that it takes something we're familiar with, chess and the movements within chess, and turns them into this spatial puzzle between two players. There is an element of luck with the dice, but because the board is three by three and you can't undo what's already been done, philosophical, the um, moves that you can have and the ways you can manipulate the board uh, can either set you up for a future turn or put a spanner in the works for the other player. You would think a game like this would end up being just back and forth, back and forth, changing what people can do and where people can do it. But actually it plays out more like a fairly pacey tug of war where you're just kind of go it taking one bit at a time, one bit at a time, and all of a sudden everything falls into place and uh, you take that round. There have been some changes even while I've had this preview copy which make the game faster and uh, more uh, playable, uh, which all in all makes for an excellent package. The artwork and components of this prototype are phenomenal. So even if this fulfilled as a Kickstarter, as it is, uh, you would be very happy with this package. So if you like quick, portable, travel travelable, it's a word, two player games, then Division the Throne uh, or Throne Room is absolutely up, will absolutely be up your street. If you like chess, it'll be worth checking out. Uh, it just works incredibly well. Also, the solo mode of only having a limited amount of dices, dice, dices, <laughs> what's going on? Dice to maneuver the, um, the board, the, essentially the board, works really well as well and again is incredibly quick. So that is Division the Throne Room. 
check it out on Kickstarter down below through the link. And thanks for watching Board Deck and Dice.